What's going on everybody? It's your boy Payne. Welcome back to another video. I just want to actually cover what's been happening since I've been back. I'm going to give you an update on the channel. I did this I think the first week I got back. Now we're at 16 days guys. A lot has changed and I want to just thank you from the bottom of my heart for consuming this content, uh, engaging with me and being such an amazing community of people. Uh, not just gamers, but just people, right? So I want to just walk you through the channel. I want to be completely transparent on what's been going on in the last 16 days. So we're going to just show you real quick uh, some content here in terms of uh, my first first drop video. Uh, it came out on the 24th, I believe, and this was my first video after a year of being off from making content at all. I wasn't even planning to come back, to be honest with you guys. The, the idea was just to play the game in silence, not even really be on Discord ever. Just kind of enjoy enjoy what I was doing, right? But as you can see here, um, this was the this was the first video, March twenty fourth, right? And I looked at the calendar. We're currently what? We're at April 9th, and that's sixteen days I've been back. So a little over two weeks I've been back. Okay. Um, <clears throat> within those uh, sixteen days, I've got to know a lot of you, which has been great. But my channel has grown. Uh, leaps and bounds compared to what I expected, I guess. I, I talked to one of my boys, Luke. Uh, shout out to Luke, who, who's a, a mod on my channel and also like a mod in a couple other discords. And I told him when I, if I decided to do this, I just wanted to come back to 8, 8k subs and just have fun with it. Like, and that that still stands. I'm just having fun with this. This is not a uh, not a gig for me. A lot of you know this already. I do this because I want to. Uh, but it's always nice to be rewarded with the. Uh, the positive outcomes obviously right so let's just go through this okay real quick before we even continue with uh, the actual uh, numbers I just want to show you guys in 16 days this is crazy I don't know what the hell I've been doing with all my time but in 16 days I've dropped 97 videos yeah it's a lot of content I was actually gonna drop three more videos today on top of this seven videos I dropped to make 10 but I decided to hold back because I feel like I don't want to inundate you guys with too much pop-ups if you're subscribed to me, right? Uh, and you have the notification on specifically. So I decided to stop today at 7, I think, or 6 or something. Uh, but I would have made 100 videos in 16 days. Uh, that's that's a pretty absurd number. So uh, I'm shocked that I'm pro putting out this much content. But quite honestly, I'm going to be straight with you guys. And I've been straight with you guys from the jump, right? There's been no hiding anything about me or about what I'm doing. These videos have been the easiest videos I've ever had to do with content. I don't even have to think. The reason why it's been so easy is because I'm doing it because I'm enjoying it. And I think that this this is the you know age old tale of if you do something you love, it comes naturally and I feel like that's kind of what's been happening and the fact that you guys are enjoying the videos, it makes me want to think outside the box. For example, we did the wedding tier list for Street Fighter Duel. We did uh, you know the, the whole spending whale uh, hierarchy one. We did, we're did. we doing some lore videos and I'm going to continue doing those. They're not the biggest hits and I don't really care. Some of you guys enjoy it and hey, you know, it, it's it's getting it's getting engagement between with me and you guys, right? So, um, so I think this is another one that I want to just kind of show from time to time and kind of thank you guys with, for what's going on. So let's actually go to the dashboard. So 97 videos in 16 days. I have to pat myself on the back on that one as well. Uh, so let's kind of talk about what's been happening here. I'm going to do analytics here so you guys can kind of see. So in the 16 days uh, I have uh, received 218,000 views on my channel. So views you can see up there. That's 2016 uh, more than March, but March doesn't really count. I mean, because I was here for six days and I just got introduced to you guys, right? So uh, April's really the real month here. But you know what? They're taking into account about 216,000 more views than my my March amount, right? So that's that's. So thank you guys again for for watching. Um, this one I think is even more impressive personally, but. Uh, 18.5k actual hours of, of content being consumed by you guys. So uh, again, I, I don't know. I have I don't know where I'm getting all my time to make these videos, but I don't know I don't know where you guys are getting all your time to, to actually watch them. So big ups to you guys for doing this, and I just want to thank you um, because I feel like your time is is just as precious as mine, and it, it means the world to me when you guys are using that time. To, to be a part of my journey so uh, and I, and I want to make this about us right so I want to say our journey um, so we'll move on to the next thing here so 
in terms of subs, uh, I've got uh, 1,953 subs in the last 16 days, which is pretty exponential because if you don't know my history on content creating, when COVID came out and, and I started doing Ninja Tribes, I was the only Ninja Tribes content creator. My first time on YouTube ever, literally watching or doing things. I never touched YouTube at all. Uh, just wasn't into it, right? Um, I was also playing sports and doing stuff outside. really wasn't on the, into the virtual social media stuff. But uh, <clears throat> it took me six months, I believe, to hit my 1K on Ninja Tribes. So this blew it out of the water instantly, right? But I guess it helps having experience in, in content creating and knowing what I how, how to speak, how to engage, how to talk, how to break things down, and, and kind of understand how the gotcha world works because I've played hundreds of gotchas, right? So uh, I just want to thank you guys for subscribing. I know a lot of you don't have to, uh, but I do appreciate the ones that do. And, and even if you don't, I appreciate you just taking the time to watch my content and just even be a part of it. So again, thank you guys so much for that. That was uh, unexpected. We're almost, we're almost approaching the 10K mark. Uh, I'm almost there right here. So hey, if that happens, great. I'm happy. If it doesn't, it'll happen eventually, I'm assuming, if I stick around, right? So, uh, and then of course the revenue part, um, <coughs> this one, this one I, I will eventually share with you guys. I will probably, when I hit 10K subs, I'll probably do some sort of like, um, uh, like a, a giveaway of some sort, maybe an Amazon card or something, right? I found it in the past, I used to do giveaways and because I'm Canadian, a lot of Americans watch me and um, PayPal and all this other stuff didn't work out because Canada PayPal and, and, and this all, and people weren't comfortable giving PayPal information away. I tried to do like Google uh, gift cards, Canada store can only do Canada uh, clients. It, it was just all weird. So I'm going to try maybe do Amazon this time and see if that works or like some sort of like a Visa card or something. Uh, but yeah, I will definitely be doing giveaways because I believe this part here, obviously, as much as it's my hard work is you guys are the ones watching and so I'm getting some money for it. Uh, hell, it's helping me pay back for all my whaling, right? Uh, and I'm not, and I haven't spent a penny for, since MH Ken, guys. Like, not at all. So, since vehicles came out of MH Ken, I have not spent a penny. So, uh, for those people who are like, oh, Payne's the biggest spender in the game, I promise you, I'm not even top 50. Promise you. Like, not even close. Um, and I haven't been spending anything at all. So, for those who are like, oh, Crunchyroll talks to Payne because he's the biggest spender. You, I don't know where this information is coming from, y'all. Y'all reaching for that one. Uh, I'm just a nobody, man. I, I, I'm just, I, I've been back for 16 days. Who the hell's going to care about a guy who's been back for 16 days? It's crazy to think that. There's been people who spent hundreds of thousands. I'm not kidding you. Hundreds of thousands on this game. Uh, they would get dibs before before I did any day. But anyways, I digress. That's not the point of this. So I just wanted to show you guys this real quick. Um, so I want to thank you. The top content of most videos have come from the first ever uh, video that I made here, which was the, the best top five pay to win free to pay units. Uh, still works really Really well uh, still applies to be quite honest minus a few changes but the changes were made here so this one is also getting some traction not as much as this but I find this video is actually the better of the two to be honest so if you guys are looking for a video to watch sorry this video being right here uh, if you guys are looking for the, a better video of the units to watch this is more up to date and I will be doing a real tier list as soon as Akuma comes out I don't want to do one before that it just didn't make any sense to do that so I will wait to do that but as you can see here uh, some of my top videos have been the uh, team building one which a lot of you guys are loving and, and took advantage of and have come back to me and told me hey man thanks for helping me out with my game I was stuck now I understand uh, the way yeah, this one's funny because everybody wanted to see what the CR title was for me and it, it was just arrows pointing at me calling me stupid for spending that much money um, the shop guys is doing really well uh, you know what's killing your progress so, so all these guys are, are doing really well and I'm really happy guys that you guys are, can, are, are actually absorbing this information in and using it to play your game properly or the, you know how I can help you play it properly whatever that means uh, and at the same time I've been uh, engaging in every comment so like as much as possible, these are all new comments um, I've engaged with almost literally every single comment I possibly could I think I've maybe missed four or five uh, even the troll ones I've been you know engaging in so um, so again I just want to say thank you guys it, it means a lot uh, that you guys have been so supportive um, and and so uh, appreciative of the content and I'm, I'm feeling the same way so I appreciate you guys uh, much love to everybody. I know I write that a lot and I say that a lot, but I mean it, right? It's, just, it's from the heart. And I just want you guys to know that uh, I will continue doing content uh, as long as you guys are willing to, to take it in. Uh, it won't only be Street Fighter. I'm going to be branching out to other games as well, too. So uh, keep an eye out on that. I'll probably announce it when that happens. But Street Fighter will be my main game until they completely mess up. Uh, and with the way Akuma's coming, from what I've heard, and again, the speculations, um, <clears throat> I, I should be around for, for quite some time. All right, guys. So this is Payne. Thank you again for, for uh, making this happen for me. Uh, again, I'm still doing it for fun. So don't forget, I could leave at any time. I have Ninja Tribes. I literally quit a 20K account 
uh, and left for seven months until they fixed the game. I literally dropped everything. Just no content, nothing. I left. So anything can happen with me. I'm pretty unpredictable with that. But at the same time, just know I'm always real about it and I'm always going to be real. And uh, nothing is going to really stop me from doing that. So anyways, guys, I digress. Have a wonderful night. We'll talk soon. Take care.